Hi everyone and welcome to our timeless love readings. I can't wait to see what comes through for today. We are going to be using the Romance Angels. Um, I'm not sure which tarot deck I'm going to use yet but I'll let you guys know. Now I am not going to be getting a counterpart message using the Blunt Truth because on Friday I am going to be doing the pick a card for what does this person want to say to you so come back on Friday if you want to choose a message um, for your specific person and what messages they have for you but yeah today we're just going to look into like you know love let's not hold on to labels twin flame soulmate it does not matter if this reading resonates you will know cards flying out everywhere so let's have a look <laughs> okay healing family issues so either you or this person may be dealing with some issues from childhood maybe there's complications here with parents but that healing family issues card it definitely feels like um someone here is learning to forgive learning that they need to let go of the past i feel like this person has blamed family a lot or maybe they had like a really difficult upbringing um but yeah this person is trying to work on forgiveness because they're they're struggling to open their heart when they're still holding on to this yeah pay attention to the red flags in reverse so i feel like this person had been ignoring their family issues for a while and then recently they have just come out to to play you know full force this person's really having to deal with um you know their, their lessons or dealing with a relationship with a parent here which they've been struggling with but pay attention to the red flags in reverse it feels like this person was getting all the signs that you know this situation he's dealing with you can't ignore this forever but they were choosing to ignore those signs you know their spirit guides were trying to protect them trying to help them but you know they, they were just missing the red flags they weren't noticing the emotional impact that this was having on them they could have a toxic parent here who's really been interfering and we have the soulmate card so this person definitely loves you they definitely know that you are the one for them they feel um very kind of compassionate they feel very very much in love with you i feel like there's no doubt here about how this person feels for you but they 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 need to heal their family issues because if they don't they're not going to be able to open their heart and give and receive love they're going to feel very blocked very closed off um now i want to get a spirit animal for this person and then we're going to use tarot so love what do we need to know about love today Ooh, turtle we've got the turtle card so the turtle is always on a journey and encourages you to trust your inner compass rather than compare yourself to others the turtle shell reminds you that home is within there's no need to rush as some journeys take a lifetime this person has some really heavy karma with their family members um remember this could be you this could be them but whoever it is you know they're dealing with a lot of karmic lessons around family and yeah this may be like a life lesson here maybe this is going to be ongoing for their whole lifetime but that turtle i feel like this is about um that person finding shelter finding home within themselves because maybe they did not have that support around them as they grew up and now they're an adult and they're thinking well i don't have a home like i don't feel loved or nurtured by my family so they're having to do a lot of work on themselves to fill their own um their own needs now i mean guide guided to use the tarot del toro i think this one's called so let's see that's weird uh, let's see love relationships well the six of cups just flew across the room so give me a moment
yeah, look, the Six of Cups just went flying across the room. The Six of Cups talks about the past. It talks about childhood. It is also reconciliation. This is nostalgia. Um, you know, someone here from a past coming back. So it might very well be that someone does return to you. But I feel like this is more just confirmation. But yeah, look, this person is dealing with childhood issues. They're dealing with... Um, problems from their past which they've been unable to let go of. So this is someone who is doing lots of deep healing, lots of work on connecting with their inner child. I feel they have, and it, honestly it breaks my heart, I feel this person has a very unhappy child within them um, who did not feel loved. And that shown as an adult, because I feel like this person has had trust issues. They, they haven't believed in love. They haven't um, felt like they deserved love because they didn't receive it much as a child or one parent or you know there was just family complications here which have, have really caused some very big inner child wounds and now this person is an adult I feel like they are realizing the full impact of this and they're seeing how it affects them in relationships maybe this person really goes within themselves they shut other people out you know whatever their kind of patterns are in relationships they're realizing this does stem from childhood so what is the current situation here we've got the star so this is a renewal so this connection right now is going through a little bit of a transformation um i am getting the wind is changing direction so we do have um, a big change here the star is release it is letting go of the past it is making space for new things <coughs> excuse me the star is such deep healing this is healing on a soul level so this could be healing like um past life situations or definitely those childhood wounds which i feel have just really impacted this person's ability to love um the star here i feel like this person is learning their lessons and they are finding their faith again currently we have exhaustion i feel like this person is completely exhausted they are doing so much work on themselves i feel like this person is not able to see right now this person is not able to see clearly they're not able to see their options to see the path here that they are on i feel like this person is just got they've got these blinkers on and they are just looking at one thing they may be so absorbed in their childhood issues in their own kind of healing and their own drama that they are not able to see this connection right now they're not able to like divert their attention away from from this so something is taking up a lot of their focus and i'm just getting like you need to leave this person to it or if this is you that's going through this you need to just focus on this because it seems like you know that's what what needs your attention there's more time for love there's plenty of time for love plenty of time for other people but right now it is personal healing which is needed and we do have this renewal coming through we do have a renewal taking place within a relationship i'm showing a fishing rod as if someone's about to get a big catch maybe you're the catch maybe this person knows that you are a great catch um, i don't know why i'm seeing the fishing rod here maybe this person likes fishing We have the Knight of Discs. So once this person has really done um, a lot of their healing, they're gonna be able to come to you with this disc, this coin, this offer which is stable and secure. Um, the Knight of Discs here, this is someone who is reliable. They may be um, an earth sign, but they don't have to be. We've also got Aquarius energy with a star, but do not worry about signs. But this Knight of Discs is someone who is grounded yes they move slowly this is not your knight of swords your knight of wands this is not someone who moves quickly you know the knight of discs this is slow this is steady but this person is doing the healing they need so that they when they come to you they can give you something which is actually you know 
going to last. They want to grow this connection. They want to nurture it. And that means they have to take their time. Because if they come to you when they're not ready, when they still have family problems, it's just going to keep impacting this relationship. So maybe if this is someone you're already in a relationship with, perhaps they're taking some time to just heal. Um, maybe you're feeling like they're a bit distant right now, but you don't need to worry about this. It's not a reflection of you. So don't project onto this person because what they're dealing with right now is very important yeah we have the nine of pentacles so this is really guiding you towards being self-sufficient right now filling your own cup up not relying on another person the nine of pentacles this is about staying in an abundant um, in a very fulfilled, positive mindset, because all of that is really going to help. So guys, let's go straight into the extended now. So if this reading is resonating, then get the rest of the messages on my Patreon site, sacredspace.co.uk. We're going to head over there now, and we are going to get as much depth as we possibly can. Find out, you know, what's this person coming back in with? Um, when is there going to be a change? You know, just see generally what other messages spirit has about this situation so yeah if it's resonating head over there and let's watch the rest of this video thank you for joining me here and don't forget i'll be back on friday and i'm promising you a pick a card on how does your person feel like what are they going to say to you what do they want to say to you so come back on friday and you'll be able to choose your group for your messages but thanks for watching today guys and let's go and do the extended see here we've got two of pentacles but very soon there is going to be a big choice here to make there is going to be a decision about what to do next um i feel like this person is kind of weighing up their options right now trying to decide okay am i ready to commit do for the extended version visit www.sacredspace.co.uk Click on the spirit section at the top of the page and find the video that you want to purchase. You can also filter by category and choose extended. Click purchase to buy this individual video or sign up to the Evolve tier for full access to the Sacred Space site.